What's up everybody? I was just looking in my garden and I got this rock here. I've had this one for several years. When I uh, was first started looking for gold and stuff. And this is came right where we were dredging, finding some gold. It's got this weird green metallic luster. And it's got holes everywhere, like right there. It's got a seam, like several seams right there. Here's the back, same thing. Got that green metallic stuff, which could be copper or some sort of mineral like that. There could be some gold in there. Weird, I can't zoom in anymore. Maybe you guys could zoom in. It's a pretty large piece. Here's my hand. Almost as big as my hand. Well, about as big as my hand. <clears throat> See that metallic luster? That's not even in the sun. And it's not clean. It's been sitting in my yard for several years. <laughs> I have no idea what to do with this one. Break it open. Cut it in slices. Leave it the way it is. I don't know, man. There's just too many options. Let me try to get in the sun a little bit. See, show you how reflective it is. This is dry too. Let's get it wet. Oh wow, that just totally darkened it up. There was quite a few pieces like this at that place. I wonder if this is the gold ore they were crushing in that area. There was a old mining activity there. I mean, there's gotta be gold in that stuff. thick that stuff is what is that stuff copper mineral I don't think it's malachite or whatever whatever that green mineral is let's see how thick it is where's my thumb it's probably quarter inch thick I know for a fact that they say when you find this green stuff, you know, that's where the gold is, which we did find some gold. 
I, I put my uh I didn't put my dredge in there, but I did do some sluicing and we did find gold. But the problem is, you know, you gotta move a lot of material to get large amounts of gold. No nuggets or nothing. Not in that spot. But shit, I probably need to go back. And also, I uh, did see, I was reading one of my books on um, agates and stuff, and they have uh, this stuff called green tree agate, and it looks like this. It's basically white with green lines, and I got that other rock that I uh, cut in half, and it looks like green tree moss agate, but uh... I ended up selling that one, so at least I just found out the name, I'm pretty sure that's what it is, Green Tree Moss Agate, but McChubby's getting that one. If you guys haven't been to McChubby Hubby's website or YouTube channel, go check him out. He's funny and he's a cool guy and he likes rocks. And all minerals and stuff. Make chubby hubby. I'll try to post or put a link in my description so you can find his channel. But uh, maybe you guys see some gold in there. It looks like there was some earlier. You can tell it looked like it had been melted at one time. This is the kind of quartz veins they find the gold in, though. But, uh, this is some cool stuff. I don't know what to do with it. <clears throat> I'd hate to break it up just to get a couple little specks of gold, you know. Get better off using it as lapidary. Um you know, cabochons and stuff like that. Maybe I'll get my metal detector and see if my metal detector sets it off. Now, my metal detector goes off, that might be something different. Might have to break it or cut it or something. See if we can see any gold. Maybe some right there. Maybe right there. It's hard to tell. This thing's been sitting in my yard for years. I forgot about it. It was actually in my flower bed around some trees. That's sad. Maybe some in there. Maybe right there. It's really hard to tell until you break it up and pan it. A lot of this gold is small out here. Real flaky. Yeah, that's that. That could be some. Anyways, I appreciate you guys watching my videos. Please like and subscribe. Well, I'm trying to get as many subscribers as I can. And I'll have some more videos coming with uh, rocks, gemstones, 
gold prospecting. I gotta get out, do some gold prospecting. Haven't done that much lately. Been getting so many gemstones that I just haven't. I don't know. Yeah, it's a lot of work getting my dredge out and stuff. You gotta load that sucker, unload it, and all that. It's a lot of work, so it's easier just to go look for agates and stuff. It looks like something in there. Try to keep it still. Maybe you guys can zoom in. Tell me if you see anything. What is that? Oh, what is that up there? There was a bunch of this stuff there. I could have brought more back, but... Normally it's in those holes, but I would have to break it to get in there. Oh yeah, there's some more holes on this side. What's that? Focus. Well, please leave a comment in the comment section. What do you think I should do with this big sucker? Cut it. Leave it as is, as specimen. Maybe someone would want it. Break it open. Cut it in slices. Bunch of different options. So leave a comment in the comment section. What do you think? And let me know if you see any gold in this sucker. Thanks for watching.